You may be familiar with the Lying Flat movement of recent years in China. It's a protest against the 9-9-6 culture of working 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. six days a week, a protest against this never-ending ascent that we have to embark on in our society. And it's actually rooted in an ancient idea, this Lying Flat movement. There's a Taoist tale of a carpenter and his apprentice uh, walking by a great old tree. And the carpenter tells the apprentice that the tree is useless. You can't use it to make boats or anything. And the tree appears to the carpenter in a dream and says, who are you to say that I'm useless? Um, in fact, this uselessness have, has been of great use to me. It's the only reason I haven't been cut down and made into something else or, or torn apart for fruits. Um, so I wanted to take all of these ideas and put it into a song, which I wrote called Empty Ambition. And I wanted to counteract this deeply ingrained thing in us of wanting to become more successful, more influential, more wealthy, and build higher where everyone can see us from afar and admire us. I wanted to think about what it would be like to think more laterally and reach out to the people in our immediate communities and, and see eye to eye, which I think forces a posture of humility when we're on the ground at the same level. And um, musically speaking, I, I think I, I didn't want to approach it in a harmonically dense way where it's really stacked and I wanted us to think laterally as a band as well. And um, it made me think of a time in college when my mentor, Meyer Melford, um, told us, you know, even if you're playing something or singing something where it's inaudible except to the musician right next to you, it's going to influence what that musician plays, which in turn is going to influence what the entire ensemble plays and what the audience hears. So I asked my band to adopt this ripple approach especially in this song. But more generally, I wanted to adopt this ripple approach for this whole recording project, um, which is heavily influenced by the ideas of Carl Jung. And in fact, it says in his book, Man and His Symbols, that man's main purpose is not to eat or drink, but to be human. And I hope that through this project, I can give some musical reminders of our humanity.